Well, buenas noches, everyone. Lovely to be with you this evening. My name is Dorothy Jacks. I'm a candidate for Palm Beach County Property Appraiser. I am the current Chief Deputy Property Appraiser for Palm Beach County. I have served in the office for 27 years. I have worked my way up from the bottom to the top, and I'm now looking to take the position that my boss holds. Uh, Gary Nicholas has been your elected property appraiser for 24 years. He is retiring and he has endorsed me to run for his seat. I have a lot of experience in the office, as you can imagine, working there for as long as I have. I've overseen every operation that we have, including our very uh, well-regarded website, Papa. Uh, over 100,000 people visit Papa every day, and we have a lot of accolades for the fantastic site that it is. I also have a lot of credentials to do the work. I have two certifications to be an appraiser and now oversee the appraisal of over 650,000 parcels of property valued every year. We also have an extensive exemption section that I oversee. We grant over 25,000 new homesteads annually. We do all this with a staff of 250 people in five offices. It's not a small operation. I've been in a leadership position in the office for over 22 years, progressive leadership experience as a director, as the assistant property appraiser, and now as the chief deputy. I, have, I also have done a lot of work in our community and leadership roles and currently serve as vice president of the International Association of Assessing Officers, an organization of 7,000 people who are like to me. Two years ago, I'll be their president in two more years. I have the endorsement of many local people, including uh, tax collector Ann Gannon, super, I'm so, at the clerk of courts, uh, Sharon Bach. I recently received the Greater Chamber of Commerce endorsement. I have the AFL-CIO, the Fine. HRC, and so on and so forth. And most importantly, Gary Nicholas. But uh, Dorothy Jacks, August 30th, thank you so much. Nonpartisan race, countywide election. Please Any questions? Vote. this is the right person to ask, but Dorothy, uh, most of us <coughs> taxpayers get a notice and say in your bill do start November 30th, but if you'd like to contest it, you can do that, but most of us don't even understand how all that works. Can you mm -hmm. explain that a little bit? Mm -hmm. how, how would you contest and, and what that procedure would be like? You actually receive a notice on August 20th this year from our office, and in that notice it tells you what your value is, what your taxes are proposed to be, and what exemptions you've been granted, and right on that notice it says if you wish to file a petition protesting your value, you have 25 days to do that. We always recommend you give our office a call. We can talk through how we arrived at your value and hopefully come to a, a happy conclusion. But certainly, that's the opportunity you have to protest your value. So, we're, so you protest to the property appraiser's office? No, there is a there is a body called the Value Adjustment Board, and you're actually petitioning to them. They provide a series of oversight where they provide magistrates who are private appraisers who arbitrate really the conversation between the taxpayer on value and the Time. property appraiser. Can I ask just one more question? Who, who picks the value adjustment board? The, the value adjustment, can I, is that? Oh, quickly. The value adjustment board is, select, is five members, two of them selected by the board of county commissioners, one by the school board of Palm Beach County, and two at-large members, one selected by the commission, one by the school board. And that's why you should elect me property appraiser, because I knew all those answers, right? Yeah. That's us. Yes.